This is a variant of your vinegar and bicarb reaction. Uh, this time you're trapping the gas released when you react vinegar and bicarb together in a film canister. Now you need to get film canisters to have a genuine clip. If they don't clip very well, uh, for example the black ones, the seals aren't good enough, you can't build enough pressure, because what we're going to do is make a vinegar bicarb rocket. Now, this is good for scientific method. The kids can measure, or you can measure for them, halfway with vinegar or a third or nearly full with vinegar and the idea is they can ask well will the rocket go higher with more or less vinegar so we've got a vinegar here now into the lid we're going to put bicarbonate soda if you put bicarbonate soda in that's dry it'll fall straight out when you clip it on it'll probably explode in your hands so what you need to do instead is put bicarbonate soda with a little bit of water make a paste which means it can be sticky and stick onto that lid. So, I'm just going to tap a little bit out, and it's really only say, you know, that's way too much. Uh, let's just crunch that up. Oh, like a big rocket today. Right, we're going to wet that down just using some water and a pipette. Now, once it's wet, which that pretty much is, I'm going to mooch it around in my hands. If it doesn't fall off my finger, it's about right. If it's too wet, it falls straight off, and it's no good. The idea being is that you want to clip it straight into our lid. If it can't come out, you've done the job correctly. Now, if you're doing this outside, all you have to do is clip it on, turn it upside down, and step back. Of course, I'm doing it in a room with the ceiling above my head, we've got a problem. So, I've got an empty container, which will fit straight over the top of that. So, whilst it will hit it with some force, it won't go through my ceiling or anything like that. So, ideally you should be wearing safety glasses in front of kids. Down like that. Now you have some patience. If you look carefully, you'll see it bulging, pushing outwards, outwards, outwards. Eventually, oh, there we go. There'll be enough pressure for it to push down, for it to go up, just like that.